I'm grateful to share my exclusive interview with Melinda French Gates, who's writing a new chapter for herself and releasing a new masterclass, sharing how anyone can find a way to give back and help make a world a better place. She joined me virtually from Seattle for our conversation. You have something to give back. She's one of the wealthiest women in philanthropy. For over two decades, Melinda French Gates has worked to solve some of the most critical issues. Is there anything that keeps you up at night? Yes, keeps me up at night are the women I've met on my travels. And you just see what women are up against all over the world. I often think about what is it we could do to create impact and change for women around the world, both in other places and in our own country. That concern extending to women in the U.S. after the controversial Supreme Court ruling overturning Roe v. Wade, ending the constitutional right to abortion. It is devastating to see any law rolled back that has to do with women's health. Every woman has the right to decide whether and when to have children. And that should be done in the privacy of her home. The government should not be involved in a decision like that. Through the giving pledge, Melinda vowing to give away the majority of her wealth in her lifetime, fighting poverty and advancing equality for women, girls, and other marginalized groups. I think it's really important to reflect on your values before you start giving because I think your values are what should drive pretty much everything you do in life. Now, Melinda is teaching others about impactful giving. I'm Melinda French Gates, and this is Masterclass. Sharing how anyone can give back. We'll be offering you a framework and a way to think about giving, whether you're just starting or you're kind of midway in your journey. There are going to be some people that are seeing this piece and going, you know what, my rent is sky high, my mortgage, uh, food prices, I, I don't have any money to give. What do you say to folks who are, are in that situation and feel that way? I say you have so much to give besides money. You have your time, you have your voice, you have your expertise. There are so many ways we can give back. And what kind of influence do you think you have on your children? It's because your parents and your family laid a very strong foundation about giving back. So how do you see your children carrying on that legacy? I was very purposeful with our children that I took them out, even when they were young, at the holiday times to build, you know, boxes for the homeless. But then that went on to a discussion about homelessness in Seattle. So I tried to bring them in to projects early on. I encourage other families to do that. And now each of my three children in their own way are figuring out what are their talents in the world and where might they give back over the long haul. Melinda and ex-husband Bill Gates announcing their divorce last year after 27 years of marriage, keeping private the details of their agreement to split their fortune estimated around $130 billion. It is very difficult to go through a divorce no matter who you are. What did you learn about yourself during this process? I learned that our philanthropy actually called us to be our best selves. And so even during the most difficult times behind the scenes, you know, where we're working through the specifics of the divorce and their sadness, we were still both showing up for the foundation mm -hmm. and showing up well. And I think that held us together and allowed more grace during that period. And then since then, it's kind of smoothed things over on the back end, right? A little bit more quickly. I know that it was recently announced that your ex-husband, an additional $20 billion endowment to support the Gates Foundation. Were you a part of that discussion? We are co-chairs of that institution. My values are baked into the foundation, and so we're absolutely talking about the gift we gave together last summer and his most recent gift, how do we accelerate our giving given all the needs in the world right now. And Melinda reminding us all, even the smallest gesture can make a big impact. This is a time when we are all dying for more community. And I think giving back is a place that you can form community. So this couldn't be a more perfect time to start thinking about how to give back. Philanthropy helps draw people together. That I know from 20 years of giving. 
And Melinda's masterclass is out now, and she's donating the fee from masterclass to support resources toward gender equality. And she's also partnering with them to give out free annual memberships here in the U.S. and abroad. She says she's not trying to influence people on where to give, but share information on how you can learn about giving back and making an impact, big or small. And I tell her this every time I speak with her because she told me this in one of our first conversations that we had when people would sometimes be critical and saying, well, why are you doing so much in other countries when we have so many problems here? And her response is, it's not either or, it's and. Mm -hmm. It's not either or, mm -hmm. it's and. Yeah. yeah. I, I love that she also said that it's not about the money. Give no. however you can, yeah. right? Everybody's whatever it is you, whatever you can. Yeah. Yeah. If you don't have something to give, you can do. Yep. And teaching your children that is a great lesson. Yeah. That's a great master yeah. class. Yeah. Thank you, Robin. We have all, we all have different types of yeah. resources. Thank you all so much. Yeah. I got to run. I got to run, but you yeah. keep hanging down, hold down the fort. We're going to save uh, a sandwich for you. Yes, we will. <laughs> We're making something special. <laughs> I almost want to stay for that because they prepped me on. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.